This is an Arizona's Family News Update. Good evening, I'm Spencer Blake, and here are the latest stories we're following from the Arizona's Family Newsroom. A loud blast caught the attention of a lot of people up in northern Arizona, even some people here in the valley. A lot of people wrote in to us saying that uh, they heard it, they were wondering what it was. Even the Yavapai County Sheriff's Office says it wasn't 100% confident what it was, but they were pretty convinced it was a meteor. Well, a man is dead and another guy is in the hospital uh, recovering after a shooting. It happened this morning near 75th Avenue in Osborne. Police are still trying to figure out what led up to the shooting, but they say it was not road rage. Once we learn more, we'll update you on air and online. Tempe police say they believe a driver was either drunk or high when they hit and killed a woman and then hurt another man. This happened near the ASU campus right there at University and College. No word yet on whether the woman was in a crosswalk, but officers say the driver hit the woman and kept going. Police arrested that driver a few miles down the road. And there was another deadly wrong way on Arizona's roads. Wrong way crash, I should say. Three people are dead after an early morning crash out at I-10 in Riggs. DPS troopers say a 71-year-old was going west in the eastbound lane when he hit another car head on, killing both of the people in that car. Officials were looking for the man for a while. They say he has a mental illness. We're working to find out who the other people in the crash are. And our weather is warming up as we head through the rest of the week. We do have a few systems that are going to be kind of tracking to our north. The only thing it brings our way is high clouds from time to time throughout the week. Let's talk about this evening as our temperatures are going to be nice and cool around the state. We will be seeing our temperatures for tomorrow at 53 in Flagstaff, 64 in Sedona and 76 for Phoenix. All right, thanks a lot, Ashley. If you want more updates on other stories, be sure to download Arizona's Family News app and check it out on your Roku device as well. I'm Spencer Blake. Have a good night.